Hi everyone, it's been a while since I posted anything, but I'm back again with this HAC mental clock with an art deco styled case and beam band striking. As you might observe, this clock has no bezel and the front of the case is curved which is a nice touch and that's probably the reason there is no bezel It has some real nice chromium numerals and markers and hands Those do need a little clean but I can leave that for later. Also, this is the non-original key. This key most likely came from an Asian clock. Inside the clock we find this Jung Hans W77-400 movement, which means this is not a genuine HAC. HAC or Hamburg American Clock Factory was founded in 1883 by Paul Landenberger and it's also known as Pfeilkreuz. In 1925 it suffered an economical decline and in 1930 it was taken over by Junghans. So this clock is most likely made in the early 1930s. And here is the serial number and the HAC logo just below it. It would focus, yeah. Here are the chime rods and the free hammers. And this is the clock in action. This clock has a safe mode for the chime rods and with safe mode I mean that when the clock is transported the, the risk of breaking the chime rods is very low. This thing clamps on the chime rods and it locks them in place so it keeps them secured. I've taken the movement out of the case and I discovered something quite interesting. This lever right there that someone bent in the past is interacting with a cam on the center wheel and on the hour it would lift the high note hammer out of the way so only the low note hammers would strike on the chime rods which is something unusual i've only seen this type of lifting thingy on two train quarter striking movements but never in a clock like this I wasn't very active on YouTube these days, because I'm working on something very interesting. But until I will fix it, give this video a thumbs up, click the subscribe button and see you next time.